Um, I just want to remind everybody that GLAD is encouraging people to, uh, to tweet using the hashtag, I got your back, which I think is a great slogan. Unfortunately for my friend Andy Cohen, it means he has to change his Tinder profile name. But it's all right. Sorry, ma'am, you'll get it later when a gay guy explains it to you. It's, uh, it is a real pleasure and a real honor uh, to be here tonight to recognize Thomas Roberts. But I'm here also tonight to tell you a little bit about someone who's not only a great friend of mine, but someone whom I, I admire. That's right, thank you. I'm here to tell you tonight about someone whom I admire and I respect and I love. And believe me, it's not easy for a wasp to use the word love publicly. So I'm talking about my friend Kelly Ripa. Now, I don't actually need to tell you much about Kelly Ripa because anybody who has seen her on TV knows exactly who she is. There's no artifice with Kelly Ripa. She's not one way in front of the camera than another way when the cameras are off. And believe me, there's a lot of folks on TV who are like that. Kelly is smart, and she is funny, and she is honest, and she is true. Tonight, we've heard a lot about acceptance, and we've heard a lot about inclusion, and, and that's really what Kelly Ripa is all about. Every morning on, on live, every day in her work as a producer, in her role as a mom to her amazing kids, Lola and Michael and Joaquin, who are here tonight with her. And every day with her husband, Mark, with whom she now executive produces Logo's Secret Guide to Fabulous. She accepts, and she includes, and she encourages others to do the same. Kelly's work a as an ally is it's powerful. She accelerates acceptance. She promotes equality by sharing inclusive stories with her audience and by loudly voicing support for her LGBT friends and fans, myself, my partner Benjamin, and so many others. H how many morning talk show hosts have you heard gleefully recounting the Saturday night they spent dancing in a gay club? I cannot tell you how many times Kelly has talked about that on the air. Even the gay ones don't talk about that on the air. And there's a lot of gay morning hosts. Anyway, Kelly, what? It's not a secret, it's not a secret. They're out now. Kelly is outspoken in her support for marriage equality. She insists that LGBT people are, are, are treated equally, that they're portrayed fairly, and that they're portrayed accurately. She's watched by millions of people every single day, and every voice, think about this, every day her voice is heard by young members of the LGBT community, some living in places that are, that are not as accepting as New York or Los Angeles, and the message they hear from Kelly every single day is that their stories, their lives matter, and that is powerful. That's why Kelly, <laughs> Kelly steps up for GLAAD Spirit Day, uh, Spirit Day campaign every fall. She does that every year. She proudly wears purple to support LGBT youth, and she tells parents, and more importantly than just wearing a color on one day, she tells parents over and over again on that day and on many days that love is love, and that children deserve to be loved and respected exactly as they are and as who they are.